Come We're on. here in Norwich. Big oh, match tomorrow man. with the team. What are you saying tomorrow? Oh, straight, straight win, straight through to the next round. Is that what it is? I'm expecting tomorrow though. Two points. I think you said three points. <laughs> two points, you know, you can't get three points, but through to the next round, man. Come on. Okay. Man. What are you saying, Trump? Early doors, we get the get through to the next round. Early. Come on. You know how we do. FTC Arena up in Norwich. Trey's here. Dub. Mm -hmm. Morning. Me. I'm fin, mate. You doing you're right? You're right. Yeah, not you too get bad. down all right? Yeah, it's alright. Oh, Enjoy night in Norwich. <laughs> Oh, so, what's going on? You good? Yes, yes. Where's the one? Come on, man. Still no tracksuit? Still no tracksuit, man. Can't get you sorted out, bruv. What's this? What's this? Tell this guy, bruv. This guy, bruv. This guy. Bro. This guy. This guy. Yeah, yeah. Today's match day program. Yeah, no. <laughs> <laughs> Hey, don't shake his hand, don't shake his hand, don't shake his hand, don't shake his hand. Oh, no, 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 no. <laughs> Come on, Sam. Hey, I'm not wrong, Sam. He's 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 not How are you feeling, Marcus? Good, man. Feeling good. What do you, what do you expect today? Uh, cheeky five. Cheeky five? Cheeky five. Through to the next round? Come on. Silly question. What? But how can they have the results in here? What are you expecting today, uh, Dale? Yeah, okay. They brought us they brought us on the big pitch to ambush us, brother. Is that what it is? Yeah, yeah, yeah. They, they come to ambush us on the big pitch. <laughs> You expecting some good football today, though? Mm. Huh? You expecting some good football today, though? Well, uh, Kim, I expect good football every week. I think it's more important how we play. Mm -hmm. It's very important how we play. So? You know what? Um, I just want to see a good game of football. I just want to see us turn up, right attitude, and um, and play our football. I want them to enjoy their self, but play the football and, um, and get the result. Very important. It's our first time out in this this nationals, and um, we want to we want to want to make a mark here. So I know it's going to be a very difficult game. I know this team's a good team, so it just depends who wants it more on the day. So let's just hope that we want it a lot more than they do, mm -hmm. and we turn up. No excuses. Okay, let's get straight into the starting lineup. To the gaffers, myself, Selly, and Derek. Ben's not here today, but he'll be back next week. In between the sticks, we've got Martin, our ever-present number one. You've got Saul and Steven. Steven playing his last game for the club. Kevy Kevs at left back, Trent at right back. Double pivot at Inner and Kirk with Ashes just in front. On the wings, we've got Amari and Dan M. Dan C leading the line and look at the bench. Dre, Dane, Mikkel, Tevan, Tyler and Wackers. Okay, let's get into it. Myself, Kevy Kevs, alongside Django. So today we've got FC Steamers from Norwich. Uh, it's our first appearance in this year's or ever in the National Cup. So let's see what happens. So with Martin, looking for a bit of options. Uh, I told you, oh yeah, it was it was bacon today. You know, decent pitch as well. Look at it. Nice. I don't know about that touch there. Yeah, that no, was a bit slippy from, from, from Saul, but it's with Trem, speed star. All right, that's a delightful ball over the top. It's with Dan C, Dan C just in front of goal. All right, you've seen the push. Is he going to go down? and gone down. The it's... referee's given a penalty. The game's only just started. Yeah, you can't argue with that. 
And we look at him, it was clear. Through and goal. He just oh. shoved him in the back. Defenders gotta let him go there, surely. Look, referee was quick. He was quick to get to the you know point to the spot. And it's with inner. Inner. You saw exactly what he done in the previous episode. Look. That's a short runner. Nah, he, he's got it about him, no, to be fair. Look, look, look. That's all the same game, you know? Three pens in one game. And he steps up here. How is he or where is he gonna go? Let's have a look. Ah, uh, no problem for Inner. He puts the boys 1-0 up with three minutes on the clock. This is this is a perfect start. Perfect. I mean, if you're hatch lane, you can't complain. That's what I'm saying. You always want to start on the front foot, and that's exactly what they've done. Exactly what they've done. Look at that. Side foot into the bins. Inner puts the boys 1-0 up. So let's get it. There's some ball over the top. Easy, what was that? That's decent hold up play from the from Alan Shearer. He's thinking past a couple. Kev gives it back to What catastrophe defending was that? You heard the fans. You heard I mean you just heard them. They were they, they couldn't quite believe what they were seeing because their team has not equalized. You can see the dad or uncle there on the sidelines wishing that his son had scored because he knows exactly what that's gonna mean to the Norwich locals. He might even make a move after that goal with the attacks, you know? But uh, yeah, anyways. Trem, lovely interception. Runs past one, runs past two. And oh, hey, ref! Ref, get on top of it, please. Look at this. That's nasty, man. Nasty from you, fella. It's poor. It's gone over the top. He's left something on Dan. No man, you can't be doing them kind of challenges. Them kind of challenges there will have the referee brandishing a red card, but on this occasion he's only given a yellow. Inner looks to dink it over to the far post away from their fullback. And it goes off a corner and nothing comes about it. So the right midfielder is thinking that he's Ronaldinho. Oh yeah, to be fair, that's a decent ball. It's causing a lot of problems to our defence. It's with three. Three. He's fallen over. Oh, when I saw this live, I didn't actually even think anything of it. But look at it there. Look at it here. I mean, you've seen. Uh, I don't know. Don't know. Don't quite know what to say about that one. Because um, a big guy like that, or a big man, shouldn't really be going down so easy. Kev waits for Amari to set his run and plays a lofted ball over the top. Amari one on one with his defender. Chops back, looking for options. I don't know what he's trying to do there. Anyways, it's retrieved by the left back. It's Ash to Dan. Dan, lovely bit of skill there. They can't get near him. Kev looks inside the box. There's nobody there again. I mean, it was it was definitely banned for Dan. If it was a little bit higher, but there's no one else making that run for us. Uh, Kev looks to give it give it to Dan. But it whips it. Dan. He's got one, two man ahead of him. He thinks into the box. Nah, this is getting ridiculous now. Nah. Lads. Emphasis. I don't think I've seen us cross the ball so many. Hold on a sec. Hey. Was that close? Because I don't think we've got a good angle on that one. But it's just gone past the post. It. Referee's giving a corner. Nah. Ref, stop it, please. They score from this. Defending and it's away from Ash. But I was gonna say if they scored from that, mate, oh, hey, we would not have been happy. Martin finally involved in the game. He looks up, he hangs it with a lot of air in it. Dan brings it down. It's with Ash. Ash Jinx boss is first defender. He shows them the ball and no wait, pause. You know what I mean. Anyway, Amari gets to the byline, puts a low cross into the box. Nobody's there. As I was saying, yeah, this might be the one game where we've crossed the ball so many times, but no one's been in, in the box. It's with Shera. Hey, Shera, you're not doing bad, you know, fella. Hey, decent. Oh, that reminded me of Gabriel Heinzer and Patrice Everett, what Kaka made, made them to do all those years ago. If you're too young, Google it. 
But yeah, I, I gave me slight flashbacks thinking that that was about to happen. Left back, hey, left back. Remember I said, we got something for you. Number three, we got something for you, mate. Just keep watching, keep watching. Anyway, our player's down, Amari's down. That's what the boys were screaming about because FC Steamers didn't want to give us the ball back. Fair play. And I mean fair play as in not like fair play to them, but I mean fair play. Where is the fair play? Where is the sportsmanship? But of course, it wasn't a head injury, so that's probably why. And they looked to take advantage. Who wouldn't? If you're 1-0 down in the Nationals, hot lofted ball to the box by the three. And Saul does a crow turn, lovely jubbly. Oh, look at the switch. It's Kev. To Dan. Dan looks over his shoulder. Dan. He looks to whip it. And just like Kevin Ash, he couldn't find the back of the net. He couldn't, couldn't, couldn't get on target, to be fair. Oh, yeah, I don't know. Hold on a sec. Amari might be able to get this on target. He has got it on target. But it's nothing to sting the goalkeeper. So we move. Oh, good enough. Tries to find the big man. So he's giving it away, nope. Tarot looking for a bit of movement ahead of him. Kev gives it to Dan. Dan back to Tarot. Oh, this is lovely play. Is he going to find Kev? No, he's not. It's going to turn out. To Dan. Twos of Dan. To Inner. It's all very side to side for my likings. There's not enough movement and penetration to actually make it to the box and make it to the box because crosses like this come and nobody's there. The, the, the crosses ain't, ain't good enough or... I don't know. But one thing I can certainly say is that I don't think I've seen Hatch cross the ball so many times with nobody on the end of it. Chum. Oh, uh, he said the better defended. Oh, get up, fella. Get up. They're, they're looking to go down at every opportunity because they want a bit of a, you know, they want an advantage in order to score. That, is that foul? No, that's not a foul. Even though he's giving them the cane clothes line. And he's giving that as a foul. Come on, man. Ref, make it make sense, please. Make it make sense. FC Steamers, it's dying embers of the first half. Number 11 is looking to whip it into the box. Uh, the referee just had a word with Kev and Trem there because of what Trem said. Uh, number 11 does beat the first man. And uh, it is. Uh, ooh, ooh. Uh, Amari slipped up. Ashan. And that's the half time whistle. At the break, it's FC Steamers nil. It's Hatch Lane 1. Look at those watches, look at that jewellery. Rings, watches, anything that you might need. If you're trying to stun, if you want it on your wrist or your finger, flash time piece. Head on over to the Instagram, make a purchase, or just simply send them a DM and they'll get back to you as soon as possible with whatever bling that you need. Yeah, yeah, yeah. 
Okay, so it's with Dan now. Dan plays it to Inner. Inner. Says Murray. Inner was on his left foot. I don't understand why he didn't take a shot there. I know, I know, I know, I know. He's looking. I don't know actually. Good, good statement. Um, decent ball outside of the foot by T. I tell you what, T. Some people are going to be needing your services. I tell you that much. Anyways, it's with Amari. Amari sizes up his defender. He saw two men ahead of him. He gives back to Kev. Kev to Ashan. Uh, decent, decent pockets and spaces that we're picking up here. Uh, nah, I'm not convinced on that one. I'm not convinced. FC Steam is looking to counter attack. No, I say counter attack, but he's missed oh, the ball. Hey, he skipped off skip, Stephen, and Saul deals with that. Decent defending. I mean, I think you saw there the, the difference between Hatch Lane and the uh, and the rest of the the teams in the division. Mhm. Mm it's true. Okay, so we've done. Dan to inner, inner, lovely floated ball over the top to Dan, and Dan to you. Oh, hey, I tell you what, hey, Dan, welcome to the club. I say welcome to the club, but obviously you've been here for, I mean, uh, the scoring club, because that was a brilliant uh, chance and it was a great finish, look at that. Smashed it into the top corner. Goalkeeper had no chance. He was at the near post. He's not going to be happy about that. Look at him. He stayed on the floor. And the jubilation from Dan C because he's finally taken uh, a chance in this, you know, massive game. Hey, that's a salt ref. What's going on there? Oh, that's decent play, you know, from Ash and T. Oh, unlucky, unlucky. And Ash has left something on the number seven. Is it number seven? Number 16. They're calling for him to be, you know, given a yellow card to even it up. And Ash finds himself in the book. But to be fair, I don't know if I've got that. If I've, have I got that money yet? I have actually. Hey! Look at that. T, I'm telling you, they're going to need your services sooner or later. It's with Dan. Chops back. He finds Inner on his right foot. Oh. Should he be scoring there? He should at least be getting on target. He's got to be getting on target, isn't he? So Dan, okay, Dan stretching behind. Stretching his legs now. Look, he's on it now. Gone home. So T, is he going to give us another grass cutter? Nope, he gives us the ribs. Look at that, for two players taken taken out of the game just by that little red party. It's with Ash. Ash. Oh, look at that. Ash in behind to, to Dan. Dan, jinky minute. Is he going to go back? Nope. See ya. Dan, get into the byline, gets to the penalty area, puts a left foot across into the box, and that's a, oh, that's a good save to be fair. And it's with Amari, it's not gone yet. Safe hands, what on there from the goalkeeper, because eh? that could have gone anywhere, but we've got to be hitting the corners there now. And there he is, Dane is on the pitch, a fan favourite, away by Saul. It's 2 0, but 2 0 is a dangerous scoreline because anything can happen, and anything can happen right here. It's 2v1, he's just got to get Bram Martin. Oh my, hey. Martin is always at the right place at the right time, it All, seems. Always at the right place at the right time, because look, Hatch was slow to get up there. Trem's not looked over his shoulder. Everyone's ball watching. Hey, listen, if I'm him though, if I'm my man there, open, why are you not screaming for the ball? That's poor for me. Hey, and I'm make sure, I'm, I'm, I'm letting him know as well, if, you know, the fact that he didn't score, I'm telling him, I'm like, yo, you've got, because look, they can be punished here. One ball over the top. It's unlike Hatch, but Dan. <laughs> Nah, Dan, Dan, we was on to you for this chance. Because look at that. That was an easy opportunity than the last one, I believe. He's on bands, surely. Steven, decent, Steven, to Dane. Dane, got a little bit of space in front of him. He's looking for some options. He, passed, he goes out wide to Dan. Dan, lovely ball inside to Sean. Look how much space he's got. Ash is looking for something. He slows everything down. 
But look, he's got past one, he's got past two, he's got past three. He sat them all down and he sat down himself because the referee was not having it. Was that a pen? That wasn't a pen. I don't believe it was a pen, man. Martin's called into action again. It was, all, it was few and far between that Martin actually was involved in the second half. Credit to F FC's team, as they, I mean, they're holding their own so far because Hatcher have had untold amount of chances and it's only 2 0. Find decent pockets of our midfielders. Now, one on one, Amari back on this left hand side. I can hear a bit of samba going on. Hey, was that a pen? I'm not sure. Was it a pen? Are we going to get a replay? We are going to get a replay. No, I don't think that was a pen, you know. I don't think there's much you could have done about that. Okay, so Tyler's on, and so is Wackers coming off with Dan C and Ash. Okay, so it's with Dan. Dan's gone out wide. He's burst into the box. He looks up. There's only one man in the box. He floats it in and he hangs up to Wackers. Had a lot of promise, but it was never going to get on target because I think we all remember what happened the last time. Oh, mine. Uh, the last time we whipped in a ball to <laughs> to Wackers for you know to hit it, uh, it went nowhere near goal. I tell you, tell you that much. Anyways, but back and play. Six minutes left in in this uh, first cup, first round national cup tie between Hatch and FC Steamers. Stephen, lovely ball to Amari. Amari. They've been trying to take him out the whole game, him and Dan to be fair, but they haven't succeeded. It's with Tyler. Tyler, lovely switch out wide. Absolute tip as that is. Yep. Yeah. It's with Dan. Dan to Trem on the overlap. Trem looks up and he makes it 3 0. Yeah, you just heard Tyrone. Yeah, you just heard T calling my name three times because what happened was we spoke a few days before the tie. An overlap, they must give it. If they give it, I guarantee we'll score. But if they give it and it goes to the byline, we deliver first time, so there's enough people in the box to put it in the back of the net. Or the level we played, anyway, you deliver it fast enough, they'll just kick into their own net. Okay, here we are. Number three. Where's the ball going? Ooh, that's baggy. Yeah, that's loose. I got something for him. Go to T Sports Coaching on Instagram where you can book yourself in a personalized one to one or group session to work on the specifics that you need. Passing, dribbling, shooting, SAQ stuff, everything we deal with. And we're going to try and improve you and get you ready for your next opponent. Drop us a DM now and get yourself booked in. Yeah, big up this team here. I'm not quite sure what they were called, but they came out in numbers to you know to watch what was a, 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 a very good game, football. Lino, Lino, are you sure, Lino? Yeah. No, turn up. Make sure. Yeah, alright, no problem. Huh? I got VAR right. <laughs> alright, alright, alright. That's you, Trump. Trem, uh, Trem, I got that one. Trem, Trem. Trem, you have to come off. But we haven't got another sub. Trem. <laughs> Turn out. 
trying to give away a goal. We're trying to give away a goal, man. We're just trying to give away a goal. Daniel, what have you won? Yeah, I'll get into the market. Dan, energy? We're really trying to get No, we don't like doing it. We, we want to always give away a board. Yeah, we get bored too easy. We've got to stop doing this rubbish, man. Just kill teams off, man. Oh my god. Tyler, it's not real. Don't buy it. And there you have it, the full-time result, FC yeah. Steamers nil is Hatch Lane 3. What did you think of some of those goals? I think they were well, well taken, especially the first one. Um, however, there were a few opportunities that were wasted, um, which were probably easier than a couple of the goals that were scored. Mm -hmm. But at the end of the day, the win is the win. A win is a win and through to the next round so credit FC Steamers we appreciate everything that you've done for us on the day uh, accommodation was brilliant the pitch was lovely great bunch of lads good luck for the rest of the season uh, if you're not following them on their socials make sure you do so now and yeah good luck for the rest of the season appreciate you boys but it's on to the second round <laughs> If I was you, if I was them, I'd be livid. If I was them, I'd be livid. <laughs> well, Mike. Appreciate you. Appreciate you. Thank you very much. Take care. Finn, we'll chat inside inside yeah, yeah, there. Yeah. See you soon. We are on the road to a thousand subscribers and you can help us get there. Simply like, comment and share this video as well as subscribe because that is the main one. Uh, and if you'd like to keep up to date with all of our latest news, follow us on our socials. If you've got any questions or queries that you need answered, simply pop us an email to info at hatchlanefc.co.uk. Appreciate you on watching this episode and we'll catch you on the next one. Because we got the result that we were looking for. First and foremost, well done, gentlemen. Well done. Good, to see good very good performance. And, 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 a clean, and a clean sheet, which I'm really happy about. And you know what, what I'm really, what I'm really pleased about is you guys won, and I know you guys still got another couple of levels left in you. Hundred percent. Hundred percent. Through to the next round. This is what I wanted. Yeah, you know. <laughs> <laughs> no politics, no politics. The it is right, I feel the first few games we've been playing, I felt like you guys switched off a little bit. I don't know if we've come back a bit lapsed a daisy because we've done the treble and it's, it, you feel like it's a bit easy. Gentlemen, this is going to be a very hard season for us and I want everybody to be about it this season. And injuries or not, I need to know that you guys are committed 100%. Yeah. And what yeah? I wanna, what I, 100%, what I really want to big up, guys who come down. Guys, we were on the bench today, man. Yeah, Just thank you. Come, yeah, come, yeah. We come all the way to we come all the way to Norwich. We got Jay. We got Jay. Champagne camp. Champagne camp. We got Jay. Unfortunately, lads, we was only allowed to use three subs today. And the goalkeeper. But the thing is, what's a testament to what actually doing? We come all the way to Norwich, and we had more subs than them, man. Yeah. That live here. Wait, go on. So I would give man of the match. Um, you vote. The other team. They voted inner. They voted inner. They voted inner. Before we go, you know what we call this? What is it? Game, set, and a We don't take orders with this obey. Top of the food chain, never been praying. Yeah, they're helping me right the way. So the team, but we don't play. We don't take orders with this obey. Top of the food chain, never been praying. Yeah, they're helping me right the way. So the team, but we don't play. We're about this, alright?
Make the first ourselves out there on free hatch lane. Three, two, one. Hatch lane. What are you saying? Tired. Win. Win. Your analysis of the, of the game? <sighs> Slow start after the goal. Um, to be fair, I thought we should always win. Um, boys done well. It's a hot day. Mm -hmm. Just the final third is always struggling, but I knew we'd come good and boys won in it. So it's game set and hatch. Game always. set and hatch. Lovely. Come on. Don't uh, Jeff, what, what, the man, what kit do you mind for way with? <laughs> These two are captains, so work with me. If I'm calling one of you to in, it's two stop one of your players either having 10 minutes off or something to work. So. Oh my god. That, yeah. sa that says a lot. That says a lot. Well so I'm going to welcome. Yeah. So, before we go, I want to welcome Dan C to the club. He scored a worldie. But the one he missed, so we're going to chop the world off. <laughs> no, 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 no. So, that didn't score today. We don't have one brother in the team. There's only one in the They said to delete, he wanted you to delete his one down the side What? <laughs>